In a previous video, I explained to you how awesome HP Instant Ink is and how it's changed the way that you print. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up an Instant Ink account, not by going to the website, but doing it through your HP Instant Ink eligible printer. This is Wrestling With Tech, where I wrestle with tech so that you don't have to. Hey everybody, it's Alex Abrahantes, and I am here with one of my all-time favorite printers from HP. It's the OfficeJet Pro 8720. This thing is fast, it's got instant ink, there's really not much that it can't do. So I'm going to walk you through how you set up instant ink on it. I wanted to choose the 8720 because it's got a beautiful big display here, and hopefully it'll be easier to see. So first things first, I'm going to turn this on for the very first time. All right, thank you for installing HP Instant Ink Ready Cartridges. Touch OK to continue. Sounds like a plan to me. All right, so here we go. So it's saying, uh, touch continue to initialize the printer. This process will take up to seven minutes. You can continue setting up the printer during initialization. However, do not turn off the printer. All right, so we can finish setting up the printer. We have to go to 123.hp.com forward slash setup. Using the web browser on your mobile device or computer, visit the site. Okay, so I downloaded the all-in-one app, and here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to set up and add a new printer. Let's click on that. Just have to agree to the terms. Did that. All right, connect to the printer. Go to your iPhone settings, tap Wi-Fi, select the printer with the setup name. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, there it is. Let's continue. And let's see, we can create an account, which I already have. So I'm just going to log in. So here are the three plans that you get to choose from. You've got the $2.99 a month, which is going to give you up to 50 pages. You've got the $4.99, which is going to give you up to 100 pages. And then you've got the $9.99, which is going to give you up to 300 pages. For me, I'm probably more in the 100-page plan. I'll sometimes fluctuate probably between the 100 and the 300. But the great thing is I can upgrade or downgrade at any time. So let me go ahead and select that. All right, now I just have to put in my information and then uh, hit create account and then I have my HP Instant Ink account. Now that account will allow me to go online and see how many pages I printed, upgrade or downgrade the plan at any time, cancel or make any changes. Um, so that's very important. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. And agree, I've got my plan, I've got everything. I just need to click enroll. And once I do that, I am good to go. And look, my printer even says, I am now enrolled in HP Instant Ink. It was that easy. The process took me about five minutes or so, and now I don't have to worry about ever running to the store again and running out of ink. So as you can see, it was very easy to set up my HP Instant Ink account. It took me about five minutes or so, even though the printer said it would take about seven minutes to set up itself didn't take that long. So again, you have the option of just going to hpinstantink.com and doing it that way or starting the process right there on your printer. I finished it on my smartphone. It was quick, it was easy, and now I never have to worry about running out of ink and going to the store. The ink will just get mailed to me when I need it. How cool is that? So if you have any questions about Instant Ink, feel free to reach out to me. I'm Alex HP 4 qvc on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And until next time, this is Wrestling With Tech.